this is Kristen and I'm working on a video here for Catalina Council's uh, volunteers and how to work the tabbing system on a page. Tabs are great because you can put a lot of information on the page and organize it. Um, you can change the titles of these pages and the information can, uh, can uh, show for them in an organized fashion. Okay, so I apologize. This is a quick and dirty video. That means that I don't do any editing. I just kind of throw the information out there to get it to you. The nice thing about tabby responsive tabs is that it is responsive and that means that if somebody's looking at it on a small device they can easily uh, break down the information that they want to read and not have to scroll through the information that they don't want to read all right so how do we function the software so first you do is you go in and you create a page and then you paste as plain text this information or you can type in the short code um, as it reads here. This is your first tab title, and this is the content of your first tab. So then what I often do is I insert a horizontal line here, and that just gives me a visual break in the editor to show where the tabs end. However, on the front side when looking at it, apologize the horizontal rule is pretty unobtrusive and doesn't interrupt your uh, information here so people don't really so it shouldn't be something that sticks out for them so you put the information in so this is your content this is your um, name this is really important that you have tabby ending here after tabby ending you can write your end information this will go below your box that's around the tabs and here you could write in a uh, a lead in that you want to use to lead into the information that's on this page below and then you publish all right so now we want to view this page this is our first tab title that I typed in second tab third tab you can change the names between the quotes and the editor this is the information that was after tabby ending and this is the information that was before the first one so pretty easy to use great because it's responsive and works well and also great because that way you don't have tons and tons and tons of links in different pages you can put lots of information within one page so <coughs> excuse me so that's it for me if you have any other questions on the tabby software just send me an email uh, oh one really really important thing when you paste if you're not going to type your content in here and you're gonna paste it I really need you to paste as plain text the reason for that is when you use another editor software like uh, documents unless you're using notepad which is plain and has no code you're gonna pull some of that coding from Microsoft Word into here nine times out of ten when somebody tells me they're having a problem with the tabby software it's because they've pasted a paste in from another program and it brought coding in and it's conflicting with the tabby software so if you do paste as plain text that information will paste right in there so and that's a little bit about how to work that and uh, any other questions let me know thank you